Welcome to Tech Brothers with Amir. In this video, we are going to learn about the top operator in Kusto. Top operator in Kusto returns the first n records sorted by the specified columns. So let's go ahead and take a look. Here, what I'm doing, I'm creating a table called the customer, and there with the customer ID, integer type, and name a string. So there are only two columns for the customer table. Once uh, the table is created, uh, I'm ingesting uh, some data here, so uh, ID, and then uh, I have uh, putting null value here for one of the ID, and then uh, we have uh, some other records here. Let's uh, do another, uh, maybe we will do test, okay? So these are all uh, five, six records, the total we are inserting. Uh, now, if I would like to get uh, top uh, four records uh, by customer ID, and uh, I can do this uh, order by ascending or descending, uh, if I will not do anything uh, uh, after the customer ID, the order is going to be descending by default. Um, so let's execute that. Uh, and uh, this is uh, what you are going to get. Uh, so you see right there, customer ID is uh, descending. Uh, so you will uh, select uh, the table name, you will say top, and then uh, provide a number of records you would like to see by list of the uh, columns um, in this case uh, we use only customer id and if i would like to order by ascending uh, i can go ahead and execute uh, and now you see the four records uh, uh, ordered by customer id and uh, we are getting top four of them uh, if you notice here uh, there is a customer id that has null value that is coming on top of that uh, so let's say if you are interested to get the top uh, five or six or whatever the records you want to get uh, but uh, you want to get uh, the nulls at the end of it uh, so that it is possible uh, you will say customer and that's your table name then you will say top uh, list number of the records in this case i'm going to get 10 records uh, by the uh, columns uh, for which you would like to sort uh, and then uh, i will say customer id ascending and nulls lost um, so i will uh, display the nulls value at the end of it um, so let's go ahead and see right here see right there customer id that's how they are sorted and then uh, you are seeing the null at the end of it um, in my case i don't really have 10 or 20 or 30 records uh, but uh, i'm displaying all the records uh, so if you would like to get a few records, uh, let's say five records, we are not going to see this at the end because we have more than five records on top. Okay, but if in case uh, you have uh, null values and you would like to get them at the end, uh, that's uh, possible. You can uh, just use uh, nulls uh, loss at the end of uh, this uh, uh, query. So that's how you will be getting top uh, and rows uh, from your table, uh, and uh, uh, you can. Uh, place the null values at the first if you don't use anything they will be coming on very top uh, and if you will use nulls last they will come and get the end of it so thank you very much for watching i hope this video is helpful please go ahead and subscribe my channel and i will see you guys in next video